we have a fire. Smoke is billowing out now. Holy man, this thing is already engulfed in flames down here. Oh, the entire boiler's on fire. I don't know if there's anything we can do. Hello everybody, welcome back to Stormworks. Today we're doing another sinking ship survival. In this episode, we're going to be using a hospital ship, specifically the HMHS Canada. And as always, the links are in the description if you want to check this creation out yourself. All right, now to get this thing started up, we have to head down and get the boiler activated. It looks like this is the uh, sick bay area, and down here is the engine room. All right, looks like we have a ton of firefighting equipment down here, which we're well, definitely going to be needing later. All right, light boiler seems simple enough. All right. Now let's head up and get this thing out of the port. All right, now, as you may have guessed by the title, this thing has a really cool sink, that being a boiler explosion. I think what we're going to do is uh, try and see if we can fight the fire, and if not, uh, we have four lifeboats to evacuate with. All right, this direction looks pretty open, so as we're heading out to some deeper waters, I am going to take a quick look at the ship. The ship might be small, but it has a really, really detailed interior, so we're going to start from top to bottom. Uh, here's the sick bay we already saw, and through here, looks like you have more hospital beds. This just leads out to the deck here. And down the stairs, uh, more hospital beds. We have our dining hall at the very back here. With the galley. Alright, and up this way, looks like we have some fruit quarters. And also, it looks like we have another access to the engine room. So if this one gets blocked off, then we can get in here. And it looks like we have more fruit corridors all the way down here. A second galley, our lockers here. No actual storage though another sick bay and of course we have a bunch of cabins and all right we have another storage room i'm gonna grab this firefighting outfit while we're here well as some methods just in case all right so that's the interior for this thing looks like we are decently far out so i think there's no better time than now to go ahead and start the sink oh you can hear the engines revving not sound good. Our speed is fluctuating a little bit. Oh, we have a fire. Smoke is billowing out now. Oh, and we just had the explosion. Yeah, it looks like the boiler completely cut out. Nothing's coming out of that exhaust anymore. Somehow we're still going forwards. Oh, uh, not anymore. Yeah, we are dead in the water now. Let's get a flare sent up. All right, let's head down there and assess the damage and see if we can get this fire under control at all. Holy man, this thing is already engulfed in flames down here. Oh, the entire boiler's on fire. I don't know if there's anything we can do. Oh, no, 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 I'm taking damage. I am taking a lot of damage. Uh, I have effectively trapped myself now. There's doesn't look like there's any kind of exit back here. Let's heal up. Yeah, I don't think we're getting this thing put out. Uh, run through that. All right, we're, we're alive, barely. Yeah, that fire I just put out to run through was already back. All right, now it does seem like a pretty good time to launch the lifeboats, except it looks like the weather's beginning to pick up outside, so I don't know how they're gonna fare up against these waves. All right, now it looks like we have four lifeboats, so if one of these flips over, they definitely have a second chance. Let's get this thing out. Oh yeah, swing it over. Let's see how it fares against these waves. Oh, kind of hit the side a little bit. Let it rent itself out. Okay, um, and release. Oh, it is getting blown away. No, 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 come back. Oh, oh, it's getting pulled under the boat. Oh man, you can see the fire just engulfing the side already. Yeah, I think that lifeboat's kind of a lost cause. Let's see if I can get back to the ladders and uh, get back on the boat. 
It is toasty over here. Uh, looks like we're good. Uh, open the doors. All right. Oh, good thing it's a hospital boat. There's plenty of mech kits to heal with. Yeah, it doesn't seem like launching lifeboats is really an option at the moment. Okay, yeah, we have loads of damage below the water line, so this thing is going to start filling with water soon. Let me close the side doors, actually, because if those go underwater, then this thing is going to start filling up really, really quickly. Get this fire put out. All right, doors are closed. I'm going to head down and assess the damage to you. We are taking on any water yet. Oh, taking a lot of damage here. All right, it looks like, surprisingly, there's none. But I don't think it's going to stay that way for too much longer, so I should probably get out of this lower area. Yeah, there is no shop we're going to be able to put this out. Oh yeah, it is just an inferno in the engine room right now. Need to get the heck out of there. Even with this fire suit, I am taking loads of damage. I right, just run through here quickly. I want to get back to the top deck. Oh, it looks like I went the wrong way. We're gonna have to go back through the fire a second time. Just hold it down and run. Hope for the best. Looks like we're good. All right, I found my way out. Okay, uh, it look oh. Oh, it looks like I found some uh, fire hoses on the front here. We're about to be able to put a dent in this fire. How do I activate this? Oh, this is refueling pumps. Oh, I thought that was uh, fire hoses. What about this side? No, oh, it's still diesel. All right, yeah, just as I thought, there is no putting out this fire. Yeah, this weather does not seem to be getting any better either. If anything, it's getting worse. We're essentially just stranded here until the waves settle down because the lifeboats are just gonna get annihilated like we saw before. Wow, this fire has already spread it to the second deck here. Soon this fire is gonna reach the top and uh, start breaking these lifeboats before we can even release them. I'm gonna try and, uh... Oh, I lost my extinguisher? Oh, I forgot to pick it back up after I got the hose. Alright, we need to go get that back. Oh, there's one right here, actually. It's very convenient. Yeah, I'm gonna try and fight this fire off I'm getting to these lifeboats before we we're able to launch them. Alright, let me just get this one, uh... ready ahead of time. And uh, actually, that way we should be able to keep it away from the fire even better. I think I'll do the same with this one just in case something happens to that first one there. We'll get on the wheel and see the situation is oh yeah it's getting really really bad now. We have damage all under the water line. I'm surprised this thing is still floating. At least this water should hopefully put out a little bit of the fire. Looks like those waves are gradually beginning to go down so we just have to protect these lifeboats until it's safe enough to be able to launch them. Right now, though, it still seems pretty risky. We're not being overwhelmed by the fire right now, so I think I'm going to hold off until those waves settle down. Oh, yeah, that fire's making its way to the door. See if we can uh, push it back a little bit. Just spray everywhere with this. There we go. Looks like we're all right. Looks like the storm is almost cleared up. Oh, we got some fire beginning to get up here. Get rid of that quickly. Yeah, I haven't found it here any kind of welding torches, so if these lifeboats get damaged, then there's nothing to do about it. Alright, actually, I think now might be a little risky, but I'm gonna try and release it. Uh, we still have a few more in spare, in case this goes terribly wrong. Alright, it seems fairly stable. I'm gonna try and not flip it over by landing on it. Oh, and that's exactly what I did. Oh, I'm stuck under this thing. I'm gonna start drowning. Let me off. Get off. Alright. Okay, we were definitely taking on water. Our bow is beginning to go under. All right, yeah, I think I'm gonna try and release one more. So this time, I'm not gonna jump on them. Jump next to them. I might be a lot smarter. All right, well, it's really toasty here, though, on the side of the ship. Let's get in this. Come on, come on, let me up. All right, we're in it, we're good. Uh, does this have any kind of propulsion? I don't think it does, actually. Uh, oh, and it floats through for, yeah, gosh dang it. All right, well, if worst comes to worst, we can just stand on the top of it until rescue arrives. Oh yeah, look at that, water is spilling in the front here now. Oh, we gotta close these doors. Oh, water's spilling, oh, oh these aren't like real windows, are they? Okay, I need to get out of here. 
a weird plunging under. Holy man, what is going on? It is just completely going under now. Oh, there it goes under. That thing went down scarily fast as soon as the water uh, reached those uh, fake windows and started spelling them. All right, let's try and climb up on this. Yeah, you can barely even see it anymore. Somehow it's still on fire despite being underwater. But yeah, it is gone now. I think that is the fastest I've ever seen a ship go down in this game. That was absolutely crazy. Well, this thing is hard to stay on top of. <laughs> Alright, well, I think that's going to do it for today. Sinking Ship Survival. Somehow we made it out of that alive. As always, if you have any suggestions for future episodes, make sure to leave them in the comments down below. I will catch you guys in the next one.